In this tutorial, we'll show you how to process a sale of one of the items that we previously entered in inventory. There will be that uh, shampoo bottle that we got set for uh, selling through uh, its um, barcode. So you can uh, scan the barcode uh, of the shampoo bottle with your barcode scanner. That's what we'll do right now. But keep in mind, you can also um, type it in manually for extreme cases where I don't know if the barcode is damaged and you can't scan it for some reason. So as you can see that was uh, placed in uh, the main sales screen with the correct price, tax and everything. Um, right now we have as a payment method as a default always selected cash. Here are your other payment methods. Let's just do a simple sale in here. We'll just click tender uh, the cash collection screen shows up where uh, the correct amount is pre-filled in the box already but in this box you would actually fill in what you're getting from the customer so the software can calculate the correct change uh, if they're paying with exact cash all you need to do is hit enter or click OK in here because the amount is pre-filled if not you have a couple options you can manually edit uh, with this uh, numeric keyboard in here or your original keyboard of your PC or if they're giving you a paper bill uh, you can select any one of these buttons so that the correct change is selected let's say like they give you a 20 you know it fills it in for you as soon as you hit OK uh, it goes to the next screen um, this screen is the customer collection info and it only appears because we selected and set up that we are going to collect uh, customer info with every sale. So uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to en enter some details about this customer. Of course, if it's a pre-existing customer that we've uh, already entered in the system and they're just coming back to our business, as soon as you enter their name or phone number or email or any unique identifiers like that, uh, it, all the info you have on them will just show up. And if you ever feel like not wanting to do this uh, and skip sometimes, you can always just click this skip screen button. Go ahead and click submit in here. And it'll tell you that your change uh, that you need to make to your customers is 1572. And that's how you make a simple sale.